Hello, boys and girls, my name is HotCC and welcome back to Beltless Factorio. Uh, in the last few episodes, we have been hard at work uh, optimizing uh, various parts. So I think today we will take a step back and see where we got and what next steps are. And for that, let's look at uh, our production. And we take it um, top down, means, um, uh, shall we look at 10 hours? And we are interested in blue circuits. You can see there was something really bad there and the thing there was uh, we added quite a while ago this refinery down here but what we forget to do is connect the output of the um, uh, petroleum gas with the rest of the system so basically these back locked pretty quickly. So I added uh, this pump here so we can actually um, move that out. And due to that fact, we had not enough uh, uh, sulfuric acid, um, which then uh, also is a problem for blue circuits. And let's jump back in here. We can see we can reach pretty high production, but this peak is probably uh, during this period we delivered stuff and stuff and it just had the sulfuric acid lacking. So when then that came in, everything started and from there it went a bit downhill but overall i think what we can see we have fewer of these drops where we actually go down to zero we had some here uh, it's always peak and then back to zero peak and back to zero and we seem to have less of these i mean if we look uh, at a, at an hour we still have basically downtimes where we are not producing anything so let's let's see and figure out why that is um we have a train coming in here. We have no train coming in there. Um, looks like down here all factories are running. Oh, these are not because we are lacking green circuits. So maybe we need more delivery trains. One more should I think then up here we I mean here we, we see uh, the, the green circuits have not really backlogged that far so in order to get everything running we might need uh, more trains delivering stuff. Uh, here we could, I mean, we have two stations where we could pick up blue circuits. Um, looking at it, a bit more than a thousand and a bit more than a thousand. So that's good, which means uh, we should not have any trains at the waiting bay for blue circuits. It 
if I can find it. Or is it up here? Get that steel. And then we have two empty ones. Not sure where the waiting bay for the blue circuits is. But one thing that I saw is that crude oil is pretty low. And that means petroleum gas is pretty low. Which means we are not producing that much uh, sulfuric acid. So looking at our, here we are at 400% remaining, here we are at 500 and 600. And the next ones are out here and there. And I think that's a bit closer. However, there we probably also have then to, uh, to see pollution cloud in that direction. I mean here we do have a bit of, of forest that can help us but I think first step is uh, hooking up um, this oil field which has one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, eighteen, nineteen, twenty, 21 boreholes so uh, I will probably need to craft a few of these maybe we have still some laying around somewhere uh, in some chest let's see what I can find and do all the pumps are in and are pumping and that should give us a bit more crude oil yeah i also added four tanks here on this side and, and then have a split off to the upper and the lower refinery and that should really help us out with the with the petroleum gas uh, however, another thing that I noticed is this setup here where we have coal liquefaction. Um, that of course only works if we have coal to liquefy. And by the looks of it, uh, the patch that we are mining here is getting a bit um, thin. So let's do this. Have a, a second line there. You can do that. Need to move that one further up. And then we can have that input there as well and while we're here let's remove the miners that are no longer in use you can see that by that red icon I think up here we can add one more all good that should also produce a bit more uh, petroleum gas from this setup because i think for our rocket fuel production we're pretty set as we have backlogged here 
for quite a while. And that should help uh, the uh, sulfuric acid shortage for the blue circuit production. Um, but then let's have a look at, um, at other things. Yeah, in the last three, 30 minutes we did not have a drop all the way down to zero, which is good. And I did add uh, an additional train, so that might also help. Uh, looking at the red circuit production, um, we are also up there, a bit fluctuating. Um, and you can see here, uh, that's, um, that's probably where we put in the, the second, the second factory for the red circuits, because before we were plateauing, which means we were backlogged in, in materials, all the, the assemblers were running and just pumping out stuff and um, that's actually what what we want to see however we uh, have to make sure that the output that we get uh, is uh, also used uh, and and that's 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 what we need so for Blue circuits, we see we are producing around one and a half circuit per second. Uh, and we are, actually, we are not using that much. So I think, at least at the moment, we are there. But then again, we are... Uh, not doing any research progress, which probably means we are not producing any science packs. Well, we have in the last 10 hours, um, but probably not so much in, in the last uh, hour. So consumption there is probably lower. And maybe in one of the next episodes we have to to look into uh, where is the, the bottleneck with uh, the science production. But one other thing that we did last time is we cleaned up uh, all our um, copper fields um, well, there is again work to be done, but I think cover supply, we are good. This one does not exist any longer. However, we have some up here that we have not yet labeled. Ooh, we have quite a few that are missing an icon. And with that now gone, basically we can connect this roundabout and this roundabout. Problem is, as you can see here, the lines are offset by two tiles. So we will have to have a kink in it. So, and, and what I am thinking we might do is we, uh, in, instead of wiggle it like this, we uh, uh, wiggle it up here uh, over to this side and then down here 
back to to where we need it so for that i probably need a few more uh, rail pieces Ooh, that was close that was close so let's grab a few and then we can head up there and while I'm working on that section um, that probably means uh, it will be closed for through traffic Ooh, that's been a long time since a car run out of fuel usually before that happens um, uh, the car is destroyed in some unfortunate accident so let's let's cut this off here collect all the rail pieces that we have there And then uh, let's see. Yeah, let's bring this over here. Probably we want to have this then lined here somewhere. Can can we make that work? No 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 no. way and that way and then let's see we will not manage to get another signal in here but I think uh, as far as uh, kings go, it's a pretty nice one. So then I think it's probably best to grab a piece like this here. Place this, place this in. And we will remove that part. And probably all the way up. Right. 
let that all disappear. And then let's see, we need basically a section. right up to the to the next to the next crossover and then let's try to place it right over it don't need that one and this one that we will have to see bad signals. That then means we connect this here and there. Uh, have signal there and signal here. Probably we'll want one here. And then we have the next section there. This one should go better. back a bit that was one too much this signal here here and signal there and let's put it there and then the last piece up here. What we need first is this crossover piece. Let's see. Let's and basically on the other side should be the same. Then we have this middle piece here. If I can wiggle it right way around, goes to there. 
probably has to be this way. Signals. And the first train already passing through. Second train. Ooh, looks like a, a popular route. Almost good. We are liking the signals here and here, and those here on this side. And with that, I think we have our new high speed connection north south that we have been waiting for so long. All right. Now let's have a quick look um, to finish off this episode. I think um, the green ones, they're pretty stable, though we are consuming or we have consumed in the last hour more than we have produced. Um, might need to look into that. Um, on the for the red circus we have produced more than we have consumed so probably there is not that high a demand for red circuits and if we look at uh, the blue ones uh, as said um, we have not produced as much and here we are uh, currently, we are are higher. It's almost uh, three circuits per second. So, uh, I think we are on the right track. But um, I think uh, we really have to also look at uh, science production. And another thing that I noticed is we're using quite a bit of power. So maybe also um, the power production um, should be looked into before we uh, expand more. But that's it for today. Hope you enjoyed it and uh, also tune in next time for more Build Less Factorio. Goodbye!